Hey guys, Popular Boat here, and today we're playing some more Huntsman 4 in our uh, Netherlands Steel Wall campaign. And we are actually maintaining a pretty solid steel wall. Um, alright. We've slowed down a little bit as <clears throat> Germany's regaining its equipment more. Um, we're gonna have to slow down because of Fran uh, the winter coming as well. With the AI actually producing more diverse divisions, we have to be a fair bit more careful. But at the same time, they are struggling to keep up with production to fuel all of their divisions. Let's go to speed 4 while we plow through this winter. And while we wait, we might just let the orange group train up. Germany's not being very aggressive, they've got a lot of divisions on our border, but they're not doing a whole lot. train everyone. These guys have a few divisions that are pretty close to being regulars, so I'm just going to train a lot of them. Just until they reach that point, and then we're going to switch it back. It will be burning through some extra tanks. We don't really need to be burning, but we've got spares for now. <clears throat> cool, secret weapons focus is done. Let's get equipment effort three. Germany's done their second Vienna war Vienna award which splits Hungary and Romania a bit. Okay, that's good enough. Once these four get trained up, we'll turn that off too. <clears throat> right, these guys can build up their planning bonus, then we might start pushing a bit more again. Germany's being very cautious. Very slow and very cautious. France is actually pushing Germany back, so how about we let them into our area too? Rather than wasting time staying on our border, they can help us push into Germany. Okay, these guys are getting their training up. Could we get air superiority over north... What's that? Northwestern Germany, I wonder. We should probably... get some air bases built. Those guys are probably enough, have had enough training for now. France is flooding our area with troops. Let's do some pushes, kind of test the waters. Oh, we managed to push Germany back somehow. Managed to get air superiority, so we can move our tactical bombers up. Ok, 
Okay, Germany can pierce our divisions again. <laughs> we open our borders to France and they immediately start losing again. Alright, we have next level fighters. Time to upgrade those. Give them a bit more reliability. Research slot. We need attack bomber twos. Okay, Germany's pushing on us now. I'm not doing too horribly, really. <clears throat> we are fighting in open fields up this end. So losses are to be expected. Improved artillery too. Um, let's get our efficiency increased again. Alright, we are actually being pushed back a bit more considerably now. But that is leaving Germany open a little bit to being pushed back as well. Let's actually bring our bombers back, because we are doing a lot of fighting just in this region. But us having air superiority is helping out a lot. best defense Luxembourg has probably ever seen. Alright, line is being held. General's just getting better and better. Okay, we have been pushed back to our original borders though. Okay, France, get the fuck out. You've got your own shit to deal with. can't afford to go losing France. It's a whole lot of border to defend. Um, how are we looking on tanks? Plus 320 of them. That is excellent. Rebase the planes that are covering that area now that we've got the new airbase. Yeah, we're doing a good job holding our Places. G 
Germany's having to fight for each of their little successes, and then we're pushing them back again shortly afterwards. <clears throat> It'll be even better once we get the next round of heavy tanks. Equipment effort 3, excellent. We might as well finish that lot off. Yeah, Germany's starting to burn through equipment again. So now is the best time to be pushing them back. military access again? Well, no France. You should pull people off there to defend your fucking borders. Ah, uh, useless. We will just advance into French land instead. Alright, orange division or well, orange group is now at 24 divisions as well. We can modify our government. I think we're probably fine for now. Unless we wanted to switch our ideologies again, but that is entirely useless. <clears throat> Okay, we control an extra uh, extra state, which is good for us. some more. German divisions are struggling. So are the French divisions to be fair though. <laughs> We've got night assault tactics, that'll even out our forces during the day and night. Keep the pressure on. I want to hold this river line. Cool, more industry. Let's get a bit more construction. Night fighting tactics seem to be helping us out a lot. Either that or Germany really is just losing all of their capacity to produce.
Okay, we've got more free factories. Let's start a line of heavy self-propelled artillery. How are we looking? 22 days before heavy tank 2s. We can get across into Bremen no problem. Germany's divisions are all focused down in France, so we're pushing forward very slowly but steadily. <clears throat> and France is pushing back too. Good for you, France. Control more of these states. Cool, we have the Rhineland. That is good. Great news for us. Ooh, Italy's putting pushing in a lot more hard well, a lot more firmly now. Let's see if we can get into Hanover. certainly can. Free dockyards, hey? Well, how about we get some light cruisers into our navy as well? Free military factories? Wow. Okay. A little bit more support equipment and more planes. Still a few more? More support equipment. Why not? Push Germany back more. Chase them into the river. <clears throat> They're melting away quite a lot now. I don't know if it's just because we've been getting our doctrine up or... What's been going on? More factories again. More fighters, please. Trade. <laughs> we need a hell of a lot more. Chromium. We've got a bit of surplus steel, though. Soviet Union's annexed Tanitova. They're going after anti-capitalist uh, diplomacy. Let's keep pushing along. Germany's managed to reinforce up here a little bit. <clears throat> but that's not a huge concern for us. Let's cut France off, I think. Cool, we got our heavy tank 2s. Time for heavy TD 2s. No chance we're going to be able to fight into the Maginot. Let's get Germany out of here. This is my damn river. <coughs> Don't even need more of our population yet, really. We'll 
save our points for when we do. We've got that river. We just need to get. Oh, that's Maginot. Alright. Time to just focus our pushes up this end, I think. Get mech focused. Um, push on up. Can move our bombers up again. How are we looking for planes? Only a slight surplus. Probably not the best time to be using them on offensives. Or like creating new lines. Alright, uh, what were we going to do? Have we got our... No, heavy tank destroyers are coming soon. <clears throat> when they do... I wonder if... <laughs> Germany's only just befriending Japan. I wonder if Germany's, um... I suppose this is a longer front down here now. I wonder if Germany's lining people up on the Soviet border. Finish getting our river. This region of air superiority is helping us out a fair bit. <clears throat> Might as well spend some of our points on a naval leader. And let's keep pushing along pretty much the whole front. Keep the pressure up on the Germans. lines that don't need to fucking be there. Still need to cut France off with her advance. Alright, come on. Three more days till we get our next tier tanks. We've done a good job of pushing forward. It's quite a few states we've grabbed. There we go. Heavy tank destroyer twos. Let's get the heavy SPGs unlocked too and I am going to put a break in here. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. It's going a bit slower than usual but it is uh progressing nonetheless. Uh, like, subscribe if you're enjoying this, enjoying what I do, and I will see you in the next episode.